Hello, welcome back. Uh, day from this video, we will move to this chapter nine, uh, how to query uh, your ontology. Uh, the, based on the previously uh, chapter from chapter one to uh, eight, we have uh, done our own, uh, the ontology building up uh, the practice. And the number eight is uh, we have lot uh, the Michael's, uh, the the existing uh, ready ontology with uh, larger uh, the classes and the individuals uh, and the properties uh, from this one is so we will starting to practice uh, two type of the query language or query uh, the approach one is the description logic with this video and then is uh, we will move to the more uh, the uh, the often used uh, sparkle query uh, tool uh, so let's uh, go to uh, this uh, chapter. And the first uh, uh, is uh, uh, the description uh, logic. Uh, we, we shortly is, uh, talk about as the DL. Uh, it's uh, one kind of uh, the easy, uh, the, the learned, the query tool, uh, because uh, they are uh, essential, is, uh, they are uh, similar way is uh, what you have uh, done uh, previously to define classes, you just use the, uh, almost the same way to uh, write this uh, statement, then you get the result. Uh, and then this uh, uh, is quite uh, uh, the direct, uh, and I, uh, but uh, compared to the later Sparkle, it is not so powerful. So we starting learn that, but normally so we will use a Sparkle for uh, the query purpose. In the left is of uh, uh, the ontology tool uh, with uh, pizza tutorial with uh, data version two. So please open this uh, uh, the ready uh, model. Uh, and then uh, by default, uh, I uh, uh, no matter is uh, you can see this uh, uh, the tab or not is uh, just a check. Uh, I I just uh, before this video I close this tab. Uh, so for step one, uh, let's uh, enable that from the menu window tab. You can see description logic query. Uh, so also Sparkle query we will use in the next video. So let's enable this first. Uh, and then you, you can see here, uh, let's uh, familiar with uh, this uh, uh, tab. In the left is the class hierarchy. So which means this uh, you can uh, the browse your class, ontology class, uh, as this uh, tree structure. Uh, in the top right is uh, here, you can see it is the uh, query class uh, expression, uh, and you can write down some statement and uh, do the execute. Uh, if that uh, expression is uh, uh, good, uh, is good to, uh, or you want to run that multiple times, you can add to ontology. Uh, not not add uh, run multiple times. Uh, you can add to ontology if you uh, through this uh, query. Uh, you can also uh, keep updating the ontology. Uh, here is the result uh, window, and in the right is uh, uh, bear in mind is uh, here is the default. Uh, so here is the numbers of the checkbox. Query four by default is uh, subclasses is uh, checked. Later on, you will see the effect is uh, whether or not we need to check some others. Uh, and also result filter, you can have some wording to filter the result. We will see through this test uh, uh, exercise. And by default, these two are checked. So they will dis, uh, display the all thing. Uh, so uh, all thing is the super class for every class. Uh, and also display all nothing. Uh, all nothing is the subclass uh, for every, uh, every class. So by default, these three are checked. So let's uh, try to uh, enter uh, first uh, test the statement, uh, customer uh, and uh, so what we want to check is uh, all customer who have purchased a pizza that has a specimen hot. So this is the no uh, natural language. 
how we uh, describe that into the description uh, logic query is uh, same as uh, what you uh, remember is we put into the class with the restriction. So first is uh, we need to query customer. So remember is uh, you can use tab or you can use control uh, space. Then customer is auto uh, the uh, oh, uh, it's kind of the auto complete. Uh, so that is uh, the thing is uh, you are starting to write down the statement. Even we don't finish this one, we don't add any uh, constraints. So for the uh, the query uh, condition, you can whenever you see execute is okay, uh, it's not great. You can click that. So now is uh, this is your result. Yeah, but why nothing here? Because uh, uh, we just uh, show the subclass. Uh, we also need to show certain, like is, uh, let's see, I check superclass. So you can see customer uh, is, uh, his uh, superclass is a person because uh, uh, for customer, uh, if we see here, customer is in on the leave. So there's no subclass under customer. Uh, so that is uh, all nothing means uh, empathy. Uh, but customer has a person as uh, is a superclass and inherit uh, to the upper level is the old thing is the superclass. So if you check this uh, superclass, you can get the correct result. Uh, and also, uh, you can also check instance, then you can through this uh, query to get what are the instances in the customer. We have uh, created uh, 10 customers in this uh, sample model. So that means uh, you, uh, you have this uh, uh, the result directly. And naming, uh, name content is uh, if you want to just uh, query customer five, if you see here, so you see that's just uh, the uh, string, uh, the filter. So, uh, within uh, from your result. So that is the result filter. If you don't want to show nothing, so you can see, I don't want to see do, uh, all nothing, but because it's everywhere, uh, you can uncheck this, similar as the all thing. So because all thing is the super class for all the classes. Uh, so if, if you just don't want to be the confusing, you can uncheck both this uh, two. Uh, so we just have this one word, you get uh, all the customer class. Now let's add in uh, the more condition because we want to see a customer who purchased a pizza. So uh, and purchase, let's see the tab. So we got two possible results. Uh, we want this uh, customer uh, as the subject and to purchase pizza. So you can see here, customer and the purchase the pizza is not making the execute uh, uh, non uh, un uh, angry. So uh, that means is uh, you still need to finish your uh, statement because purchase pizza need to have some strings, uh, constraints. Uh, purchase pizza sum. Let's see what's that uh, output. So nothing. So we, because uh, result is uh, still uh, have this uh, uh, customer. Uh, as the uh, this uh, class, uh, so we don't have a big. Uh, if we uh, switch to here, uh, well, what is the purchase pizza? Purchase the pizza is not a class; it's a object uh, property. So that means it's uh, it's not generate any result. So uh, purchase pizza some what? Uh, so let's see has. Topping. So we are starting to has some. It's uh, you see here is agree. If we see uh, the some what is uh, some uh, maybe is uh, let let's see vegetable. Let's see if customer who buy some uh, vegetable topping pizza. Let's uh, see here. Then you can see. Is uh, just that these uh, eight customer they buy vegetable topping pizza. Uh, so that is the way is uh, you can starting from a simple query 
uh, gradually to add more and more the uh, conditions. Uh, so for our cases, uh, we want to see the hot specimens value hot. So you can see here is a uh, gray because uh, let's see the bracket. So this is the bracket. This is another left bracket. We need to have the correct the close. So now uh, we have uh, four customers. Uh, they are uh, purchasing the pizza with the hot. So similarly, is uh, yeah. If we see medium. How many? Six. Oh, so that is the the thing. So maybe so we see uh, the hot and medium. Then is uh, oh, we should have uh, value. Is this? Uh, I think it's uh, that's the syntax. It cannot be uh, like this. Let's see. So and has species value medium. Let's see whether this gave us uh, the result. No, no customer by the species uh, either is uh, the uh, the both the uh, hot and the medium. Uh, if we say all, let's see. Now this uh, one, two, three, four, seven. Oh, so five, six, seven. So six, uh, seven customer. Uh, so that that is the more than uh, complex than this uh, uh, sample. So you can see you can add some logical uh, combinations uh, to see. Uh, some customer is uh, they either buy hot or buy uh, the uh, medium, uh, which is uh, you can also say uh, they don't uh, buy customer, uh, they don't buy the pizza not uh, mild. So that that is the uh, the either way you can try to use that. Uh, so that is the first uh, sample in the step three. Uh, we will have a second sample to see has topping some has a species uh, hot and vegetable pizza and has topping some has a species some is wilder uh, milder than value hot. So uh, that that is the uh, the sum uh, the mathematic uh, the the query. Uh, so let's uh, delete that. Let's uh, so has topping some as uh, species value hot. Let's see what we got. So we got uh, two pizza uh, and uh, uh, eight uh, instance. So those uh, two pizza is uh, value is hot. So sim similarly, is uh, mild is the another six uh, five pizza. So let's uh, back to hot, and then the vegetarian. So we, we have uh, some something is uh, we are starting to see is uh, I want this uh, vegetarian pizza first as. Uh, uh, you, you can do like my ways. Uh, uh, don't uh, query uh, after all the complete sentence. You, you you write down part of the query. You try to execute and to see the uh, the interim result. Then this this gradually so you can test your query in more and more complex because you want first uh, the uh, complete set is the vegetarian pizza and then you are starting to add add some uh, conditions. Uh, condition is uh, has topping some. Well, what kind of your uh, topping condition is uh, has uh, specimens, specimens uh, some. Now is uh, you are using those uh, data type uh, property is uh, mild 
my other than value is uh, not not so hot than menu so it let's uh, count the uh, the bracket one one two three so we should have a three then that should be okay so then you got this uh, super side is a vegetarian pizza and you have two type of pizza and these uh, four uh, instances are not so hot but if it says uh, wilder than medium which means that you just want to melt uh, the uh, pizza so you got the uh, uh, the same uh, thing. So if I say it's uh, a spicy, spicier value medium, so that means I want hot pizza. So you got is uh, another uh, direction. I got hot veggie uh, pizza. Uh, so if I uh, change here, so changes. Uh, What kind of the other pizza we have? Uh, spicy pizza. Let's see. So, let's see, you got that uh, uh, Americana hot and hot veggie pizza. But I want, because I don't uh, uh, filter just uh, the vegetarian. So that means uh, you got that. And then it's, uh, you, you have so many things and you just want to have this, uh, uh, the veggie. So now you, you can do the result filter. So you got this uh, hot veggie uh, pizza. So this is the, uh, I actually, I use this uh, tool, uh, the sample learning from the exercise 33, uh, and hope is uh, you get some uh, basic idea on how this uh, DL description logic uh, query means uh, in Prodigy and uh, try to uh, explore or play more on your ontology file. Uh, next video, we, uh, we will move to this uh, Sparkle and uh, talking a little more uh, during this uh, exercise. Uh, see you then. Bye.